and welcome to my first ever review. Today I am going to be reviewing the fourth doctor. With an interchangeable head and sonic screwdriver. First, let me just say that this figure was not the original release. It's the fourth doctor from the adventure set. I really review the fourth doctor adventure set pieces separately. So I'll start off with articulation. The head can move a bit. Can only do a 360 when you've got the scarf off. Just take the sonic screwdriver out. The arms, at the shoulder rather, can do a 360. The biceps can do a 360. And the elbow can go up and down, and the hands can do a 360. The waist, that can do a 360 as well. Oops, there. <laughs> and I've got his head off. Just leave it off for the time being. Makes it easier. The legs come up forwards and back, and the thighs can do a 360. And articulation knees and no feet articulation. Of course. Now then, on to detail. The head sculpt is actually quite good. Wait for my camera to focus. There we are. You can see the detail on the face. Look the eyes and the creases in his face, the cheek marks, and the teeth. The hair is black, of course, and curly. I had to glue mine back on because the hair actually came off at one point. And the hat has got little bow and is made of a flappy material so you can flap it about. The scarf is again a flappy rubbery material which means you can put him in different poses with it or just do as he did and wrap it around on to his other shoulder. And the waistcoat. Again, is highly detailed with the checkered pattern and the cravat. Going down there. The trousers are just plain grey. Not much to do, not much detail real on them. So lots of creases though, that's quite good. The shoes are a golden brown, dusty looking colour. And the coat is his red jacket. And obviously, this pocket is more bulgy than that pocket, so obviously, this one is the one he keeps the chili babies in. So you can just reach him. Now, I'll just hang on to detail of the other head. The other head again is the same with the blue eyes. Again, the hair came off as I dropped the whole Tom Baker thing I was carrying on the floor. I just think get a quality. Mm, lots of curly hair. And the uh, sonic screwdriver is just a piece of silver plastic with a bit of black and red on the end which will slot nicely into his hand. If I appear to be wheezing it's because I've got some kind of cold. Mm. Right now we're going to head swap. The head does come off like so. Mine Unfortunately, when I got it, it was welded onto my scarf. I don't know if you'll be able to see it. You see it? 
see the the, the colours stuck on the back of his neck and the paint worn off a bit. But never mind. So and of course the scarf is removal, so that means that you can have the doctor. Mine's come very loose actually. Now oh, it doesn't fit on properly anymore. The, the um, slot in it has has got pushed in, so I hope I can get a new one to replace it. But they are releasing a fourth doctor in TARDIS sometime, so I might be able to get that off eBay. So yes. Take one final look. So, thank you all for watching. And my next review should be the Fifth Doctor. Although I am going to Toys R Us today, who they have got a f exclusive Eleventh Doctor Crash set. So if I pick that up, I'll review that, hopefully. But thanks for watching, and I'll see you all next time.